Hello and welcome to my chat GPT-4 review where I'm going to be going over some of the best features, benefits, and in the end talk about is it worth getting. Let's continue. So in case you're not familiar with chat GPT-4, they do have a lot slower speed. However, their reasoning and conciseness has been really optimized where you can give it a lot of clever prompts and will actually answer them in detail for you. Aside from that, their content tends to be a lot longer and that's something I like even though the speed is a little bit slower, especially when you compare it to the default 3.5. Nevertheless, let me give you an example about how I guess you could say concise. It can be at understanding, but give me one word benefits of using YouTube for marketing, but do an incremental order going from A to Z. And I am going to talk over this. Now, normally it's going to seem like it's going to be a lot slower, but we're just doing one words here. And as you see, it starts with A, B, C, D, all the way through Z. So accessibility, branding, connectivity, demographics, engagement, flexibility, globalization, so on and so forth, exposure, yield, and whatever is down below. So not all of these are going to be perfect. Like it's hard to find one for Z or maybe something else like that. But that's just an example about how you can utilize it for better understanding and obviously create content like that. Speaking of creating content, allow me to do that for you as well. Next to put, write me many paragraphs about why marketers should use organic traffic. Just a topic I came up with at the top of my head, but this is where it's going to get better. However, I want you to be more blunt and straight to the point. Write these paragraphs almost as if a drill sergeant is speaking them to you. So without this, we're going to get some good content. It's probably going to be a little bit longer, which you'll see. But without it, or excuse me, but with it, you're going to see how the emotion and the context can completely change. I think that's due to ChatGPT4's conciseness, its ability to understand what you want to say. And overall, this is going to be the speed that you can see. Uh, what I can also do is go to like ChatGPT 3.5, put in the same thing or just the top part, and I'll show you how much quicker it is. But keep in mind, if you did want to get ChatGPT4, you're pretty much getting plus where you can get all three of those. So it's up to you if you want to optimize for speed and get a little bit less better quality in my opinion you can do that or if you just want to use chat gpt4 and get better quality a little slower on the speed that's up to you so here as it's going so I'm going to read up the top. Listen up, marketers. It's time to get your heads in the game and focus on organic traffic. You want results. Organic traffic is your ticket to success. Now pay attention because I'm only going through this once. See exactly like I'm talking about. You can literally like sense or imagine a drill sergeant kind of like yelling this at you. First off, it's cost effective. Stop wasting money on ads. Uh, people aren't stupid. They know they're being sold to. Uh, higher quality leads. It boosts visibility in search engines. You want to be the best and stop messing around with short-term tactics and focus on long term strategies. Okay, great. So this was an example of some good, solid quality content. And we can see we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven paragraphs there. So that's a good amount of content. Let me just do this real quick. And what I'm going to do is kind of show you the difference in speed, because that is like one of the, I guess you could say, uh, dislikes overall. So with 3.5, like I said, if you get plus, you get all three of these. So you can really pick which one you want to use. And let's paste that in there. What I'm going to do is talk over it. And as you can see, it just flies by that. With chat GPT-4, you could probably read it as it goes through. And you can only do that if you're like a super speed reader with that. So <laughs> give it a few more seconds. Okay, so we did probably get around the same amount of length of what's it called of words, which is it's going to change every single time. It's just something I feel like I've noticed a lot. I can't say it's 100% true, but I feel I have gotten much more content when I usually use a lot of the demos and tutorials for this. So that's just something from my experience. So something else I do want to talk about when it comes to chat GPT-4, which I know a lot of people have been upset with, is that they're unable to utilize like the image inputs yet. I've tested this many times, many others as well, where if you put an image in there, it's not going to be able to like describe what should I make with these three ingredients in this picture. And I'll say, oh, make an omelet. You can crack a few eggs, put some cheese on and salami and you'll be good. So at this time, that is one of the dislikes where I know they talked about it. I'm not sure why it's not up yet. I don't have any information on that. When I find out more, that'll be available. But all in all, it doesn't take really too long to get a good idea what ChatGPT4 has. It has some great benefits, as we talked about. Its ability to be very concise in reasoning, as it says, that require advanced reasoning, complex instruction, understanding, and more creativity. I did a different video where it talks about productivity. I say, hey, I work from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. Like, how can I be the most productive in that specific amount of time? What it will do, it can go hour by hour for you, give you breaks, and talk about the times when you'll be working, when you're not working. So it's much more in-depth. If you want that type of in-depth accuracy, then ChatGPT4 is definitely going to be perfect for you. The cool thing, like I said, if you do pay for it, you will get three of these. So if you want something a little speedier, you could always use that. But 
that's going to be overall the review. I do think it's worth it if you don't mind paying $20 a month and you don't mind the fact that at the time of creating this, the image input isn't working, then yeah, it's good to at least test out. You can always try it out and see how you like it. If not, you can always go with the free plan and then roll with it that way. So if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. I know I didn't do a ton of content in this, but I probably have, I don't know, close to 100 chat GPT videos, maybe less. I haven't looked at the playlist, but there's a lot of them. So if you want something more specific, feel free to check out that playlist. Uh, if I don't forget, I will put it in the uh, description down below. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.